Hello there. So guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your host, Ellie Moses. I just finished Squid Game episode 6. This is a great continuation. Similar to how episode um, 3 and 4 seamlessly flowed off one another with the tug of war. Um, I am about to do the same. Oh, sorry, episode 4 and 5 flowed seamlessly with the tug of war. And you can say the same about 3 and 4 as well. I'm about to flow seamlessly with this reaction, even though it's going to be uploaded at a different time. We're getting right into episode 7. It is currently hailing outside. Dale! But yeah, let's go. Let's go, episode 7 of Squid Game. Wasting no more time. Okay, that's that's just a dog way to start the episode straight off the bat. Yo, there's Ali's dead body, bro. And this episode's called VIP, so I guess we're going to get an insight into who the VIPs are from episode 5. Those who can escape via scuba diving or like, yeah, escape the facility. And then blow it up with the bomb charges. I, I knew she was gonna finesse it. Like, I knew she was just gonna get a free pass off, like the beneficial. Get out of jail free card. That's what she got. I'm happy to hear you enjoyed the game. Yes, the host is currently waiting for the VIPs to arrive. Oh, so the spectators. So there are people watching and observing to see how the games turn out, but we just haven't seen it yet. Oh, yo, he knows. <laughs> my boy knows, my boy knows, he knew the bullet. Oh, so he said you can't leave this place without my permission. So he might have some, I guess, leeway because he's a cop. I'm gonna stick by my theory I said in the videos that got corrupted from episode six. My episode two to um, five, re uh, three to five reactions all got corrupted. Um, I have a feeling that the masked captain is his brother, possibly. Damn, man, his wife went far out. And if you guys can hear that, currently Haley. Far out. I gotta mute my mic on and off so you guys don't hear the rain constantly. Bro, is this some sort of cult or something? What the heck, man? I'm really intrigued to find out what this is. Wait, did it just say the contest in Korea was the best? Does that... Okay, so I'm guessing... Oh, he just said Korea, not North or South. Uh, I'm guessing there's been... like I think it was like... No, I think episode 2 as well. Like there's games being taken place in other facilities or like all around the globe, I'm guessing. I don't know. The way these guys conduct themselves, like some privileged, rich ass elite, like pisses me off. Like they're, they're, they're just like so uptight, pretentious, like far out. Everything's ready. Damn, man! Damn, <laughs> damn! <laughs> far out. Come on, man! Like they just finished that Marvel game. They're like probably the, like in the worst state now ever in their lives. Not even like a little break. Just like yup, fifth game straight away. You gotta please the VIPs, I guess. Bro, these guys, the way they're carrying themselves, and the guys, the guys got a person as a footrest. He, no, he pisses me off. It's similar to Hunger Games as well, with them betting on the contestants. What's that thing? Ah! Looks like 
A bridge of some sort. I picked number four or fourteen. My lucky number. Oh, like one of like my one of my favorite numbers. Fourteen because of Terry Henry at Arsenal, but N four is my lucky number. I like my I like I like four. But I think the order in which they compete matters most. I try ninety six. <laughs> That's something these type of guys would laugh at. Like, bro, these guys piss me off. Like this show, this this bit caught me so off guard. I did not expect this type of like weird cult-like society or I don't know what it is, man. Okay, do it. Bro. These guys completely changed the tone a little bit, like... Yeah, Ji Hoon is determined now, bro. He's thinking smart. Oh, course left with one, bro. <laughs> Two places you really don't want to be. Going first in a life or death contest. Very scary. I want to punch these guys. In the first game, they're so annoying. Contestants in the back died after running out of time. He wants to lead the way. That's a bit star, baby. Now, the game will begin. Are these... Are these people's jobs just to lie there, naked? Like, how still do you have to be? That's crazy. It's like something you'd see at like a circus event or like... Oh, bro! <laughs> There's like four guys. <laughs> So it's beneficial you'd go last then, because the first player determines it. <laughs> you know what I'd do? I'd use my shoe and chuck it as hard as I can at one of the glasses to see which one's breaks, so I can tell which one, just to start off with. I don't want to have to keep calling you back. Sit down. Whoa! Everyone hear that? Far out. If you made it to this point in the video and heard that lightning strike, damn! On oh, the thunder, sorry. Damn! I'm gonna keep this. Oh, they said take your shoes off. Far out. Chuck your shoe. That's what I do. I. They didn't say you can't chuck your shoe. They said just take it off. Oh, but like, I'll chuck my shoe. Oh, bro. Damn. Is there a way to cheat each game? There has to be. There has to be. Oh, I need it. So I guess going last in this case is the most advantageous thing, man. Because the pathway would be set for you. Oh man, my heart. I felt that drop. Far oh, out. Yeah. What a legend. Oh.
Could you maybe, like, monkey climb across the middle? Oh, she's gonna be guilty. She's gonna get him killed by saying left. And that, that, that's me, bro. That's number four. That's my lucky... R.I.P. Oh, damn, man. Oh! Busted open and everything! Bro, that's crazy cinematography. What a fr what framing. What happens if you bend over on your knees, reach over and smash? Oh. Oh, crap. What if you just tiptoe through the middle? On the, on the pink thing. Surely that's the cheat. Oh! Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. I think he's finally going to get killed off here. He's got a long way to go. Let me guess, the ladies behind him. I want to hit that guy in the head so much. Fuck, oh, these guys are so annoying. Bro, the tension. Bro, what are these paintings on the wall, man? What is this? Can satisfy me. <laughs> satisfy. <laughs> satisfy that motherfucker. If you can satisfy me in five minutes, I might let you live. <laughs> My guy. <laughs> oh, bro, he didn't even whack a glass off. It's just like, he got whacked off. And of course, it has to be. <laughs> it has to be. I find both annoying, so actually, uh, yeah, I find both annoying. <laughs> Ride together, die together. Bad couple for life. <laughs> There's always someone that knows. <laughs> Light. Let me adjust the settings. Oh, that's dog, bro. No, no, bro, you can't do that. Oh, okay, okay. He's not changing the glass. He's just... Oh. He really did that on them. Bro, you... That's so dog, man. You can't do that. I worked at a glass manufacturing for 30 years just to be... Freaking blue board by some guy who turned off the lights. Done the trick. Yeah. Bro, why can't you just go up the middle on the metal? 
뭐뭐 뭐 없어. 어. Chuck the marble smart. <웃음> 헤이 나 e s I like the mystery surrounding the mask captain, but that exotic, rich, elite, I don't know, sex cult, whatever it is, oh, that rubbed me the wrong way. I don't, I don't know what, there's, there's obviously a message behind it, but. Whoa! Ah, Sang Yu, no, bro, what are you doing? Your true intentions revealed. Wow, the final three. That's poetic. The slow mo. Oh. Bro, that's really well done. You can see the cuts in slow mo as they happen. They're gonna end the episode like this, aren't they? I reckon the girl got stabbed. Oh, bro, that's cap. You, she won the game, bro. Why are you gonna blow like that? Oh, he's got a tracker on it, bro. He's got him. <laughs> he's gonna get him. He's gonna be like, reveal him. He's gonna be like, brother. <laughs> Wow, they ended it like that. Well, hope you guys enjoyed my episode 7 reaction. Damn, that was... That game, that game was savage. Straight savage. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed my episode 7 reaction. I was going to do episode 8 and 9 um, back to back, but I'm doing episode 7 and 8 back to back. And then we'll do episode 9 uh, by itself. So hopefully you guys enjoy it. And let's continue on to episode 8. Disregard what I say in my episode 8 stuff about linking it with 9. I'm sorry about that. But yeah, episode 8 and 7 in one go. Let's go. <laughs> sorry, this is 32 minutes as well. But it's, it's actually crazy to see how there's only 3 of them going down this stairwell now. When in episode 1, there was... I think it was about... 400 and something or 500 and just half of them got illuminated in red light green light I reckon they probably could have combined this with episode um episode 9 if it's only 32 minutes and just made it one big long final episode just a night tight eight episode season Yo, do the walls tell the- yeah, the walls tell the tales of the games. It's crazy. You can even tell with their eyes. They got like, the- their eyes are becoming like kind of red underneath and it's just like, they're going crazy, they have had lack of sleep, they're just being thrown into these games. And now they're not even thinking straight. And like these guys were schoolmates, and now they're just going at it. Oh, here we go. <laughs><笑><笑> These two better be careful not to kill each other for the final game. <laughs> Is it me or does it feel so weird seeing no one there? Like, it's just only three beds, but it feels so weird not having the hundreds and hundreds of people. I feel like it went down so quick, even though it's like... Uh, eight ep oh, nine episode season. It's just like, yeah, it was crazy. I knew it. I had a feeling she got stabbed. 
I said at the end of the episode, like, the way she was breathing, it sounded like... I thought they were going to reveal she got stabbed, but she's been hiding it the whole time. Ah. Damn. This, oh. See, dope. <laughs> I really hope that the detective doesn't die. I'm really rooting for him. He needs that one bar to do all the work of sending everything. Oh, now they get a Last Supper. Hey, now they get a Last Supper. I love how they're dressed in all these nice suits, but they still got the grazes and cuts on their face. So they ain't clean themselves. <laughs> I remember Ji Hoon in the first episode talking to his daughter about steak as well. And then how her dad and mother took her out for steak. I reckon she's not gonna make it, you know. <laughs> this guy's got big balls, man. Oh, so they they deliberately presented him with the knife to see if they take it. Is that what I mean? Oh. Oh, that's what I mean. Oh. He actually did do it. A hundred percent it's his brother. Hundred percent. I was damn right lucky he shot him in the ch in the shoulder. Oh he's still alive. He shot him in the left shoulder. Yeah, yeah, he's definitely surviving. That's a that's that's not an on-screen death. I reckon she possibly might wake up dead, or she might not make it through the night. I think Jihoon has every every right in his mind to doubt saying war well, after what he did. On the platform, and I don't know if he knew what exactly what he did to Ali, but. Okay, the propositions already. I bet just Sang was just looking across, being like, like, yo, I know they're talking with each other. The thing is, like, I'm all for splitting the money with these two, and I feel like they're not, they're not, uh, they're not trying to paint Sangwoo as the villain, but, like, he's made a few questionable decisions that are, like, a bit selfish, whereas I know Jihoon had the moment with, um, the old guy, I forgot his name, but that was more of, like, a heart-to-heart -heart still human exchange. Like, Jihoon felt really bad. I think Sangwoo's been straight out, like, Especially, he was savage on the platform one. But yeah, I... It's either... I think Jihoon will win with her, but she's not going to make it due to her injury. That's what I think. I like that, I like that. Oh, I thought saying Wu was faking it for a second. Oh, 
Bro, your schoolmates. He's actually gonna do it? Bro, surely they can provide her with some medical help for the final game at least. No, man, come on, that's savage. Sang Woo, you prick. He finished the job off, didn't he? Bro, he slit her throat! Oh, Saviok, no! Bro, Jihon, win it for the boys, bro! Win it for her brother! Okay, I take back everything I said about Sangwoo being, like, trying to be painted out as the villain. Bro, you're just... You're, like, no one is rooting for him at this point, like, after, like, yeah, no one, no one is rooting for him at this point after what he did. That's a low blow, that's a straight dog shot. Bro, how can you keep him in the same vicinity at the moment? How? Bro, to lose like that, to make it that far, and to lose to a stupid injury based off a stupid ass decision by a stupid Doctor Doom character to blow up the bridge and like, oh yeah, let's blow up the bridge so we can cut our contestants. Freaking idiot. And then yeah, to die off a low blow. That's such a shame, man. She went out like that. Okay, that was episode eight, lads. That was that was that flew by. That was really quick. That was like thirty-two minutes or twenty-eight minutes, like a Clone Wars episode. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna edit this. Um, gonna watch episode nine tomorrow. Reward myself with the finale. But I'm gonna edit it back to back. So yeah, it'll probably be possibly different clothing or yeah but doesn't matter but different time of day <laughs> yeah <laughs> hopefully you guys enjoyed that one um but yeah it'll be back to back with episode nine so yeah we're gonna get right into episode nine tomorrow but i say it now but yeah let's go <laughs>